Leviticus chapter 25, the Lord speaks to Moses in verse 1. And the chapter deals with, well, with real estate, allowing the land to rest every seventh year. It also deals with the year of Jubilee, which is laws concerning owning property. And thirdly, in this chapter, the treatment of the poor and slaves from conquered nations. God told Moses to remind the people that the land was given to them by him, by the Lord. And every seven years, he says, I wanted to rest, to honor him during that year. No planting, no harvesting. Let the land replenish itself and let the people refresh themselves in the Lord. God said he would provide food during this time that they didn't have to worry, they didn't have to fret. Restore the land also during Jubilee to its original owners. Be fair in selling and kind to your neighbors. Treat the poor with respect and dignity. Loan money to the poor without interest. Don't rip them off. God had special guidelines also for slaves to be cared for and to be set free, to be treated lovingly with respect. See, God saw everyone as his children and his servants. So let me read one verse, actually the final verse of Leviticus chapter 25, where it says, For the children of Israel are servants to me, they're my servants whom I brought out of the land of Egypt. I am the Lord, your God. See, God sees, well, not only the children of Israel, but the poor, the slaves, the land, everything is his. And he says, I'm your Lord. I'll provide during a time when you let the land rest. I care about the poor. I care about the needy. I care about the slaves. And he says, I am the Lord, your God, and you're my children. So obey me, follow me, serve me, do those things that I ask of you because, well, I am the Lord and you're my children. And you know what? God always has his children and their interest as top priority in his heart. So he lays down these rules that their land might get rest, that it might be fruitful and plentiful, and the people who live in it might be treated lovingly and fairly just as he has treated them.